of failure is uh, dealing with a pathological foot issue that relates to the career or the life of the horse. The information he needs on a radiograph to even start thinking about the mechanical plan that's either been recommended or discussed or being fabricated as they go through it is soul depth, the palmer angle, the digital breakover. Those things are incredibly interesting for the, from the perspective of the ferry because that's what he's going to be altering with every single trim, with a healthy horse or not. Those are altered. Those parameters are altered. And when you alter them, you alter the mechanics. Well, it could be to an advantage or it could be to a disadvantage. And the, the thing about radiographs, it lets us see what we can't see. And failures that are working on the outside of the foot, much like the, the artist that goes out into the woods and with a chainsaw and he attacks an oak tree and two days later he's got a wooden Indian. It's still the same tree. He's just thrown the better part of it away. And trying to sculpture feet to make them look like the problem went away is what you have to do basically without evidence of radiographs to guide you. So the modern day farrier will have to have radiographic information. He'll have to learn how to interpret it. He'll have to learn how they're made so he can help veterinarians to understand because the universities are very slow to teach podiatry period, much less the veterinarian or the farrier. And farrier schools are very slow to, to teach uh, the inside of the foot because they don't have the personnel or the experience to do that. But it's a, it's a beginning to, to be a, a whole new era for the modern day farrier that wants to strive for success with every single case.